Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Dota 2 Jungle Expedition where um, we are trying our best to get some wins. It's been going pretty bad lately. I don't know. I was really sick for a while so I didn't play Dota for like a week and a half. I only played like occasionally. I think I did like two videos in a week and a half and now I can't seem to get a single win and the competitive is approaching its end very soon so I need to like buckle up and get this done. Unfortunately, I've lost like nine games in a row or something. I think it's nine games in a row. Blah, so chill, things are going house. pretty bad. I've had to move on over to um, the European West servers because the South African servers were... <sighs> you, don't, you don't want to know, dude. You actually... You actually don't want to know how horribly bad it was in South Africa like Five seconds. Crusader and Guardian rank people pairing up with me and pff, questions that I just don't know the answer to anymore guys I think I almost felt like life what was life you know like I got to a point where I was asking myself like what is life is life even real is this even a thing you know but uh, yeah so now we're here and we are we are still going, you know. We are we are semi suffering. I'll back here, yeah. It's fine. Um, we are we are semi semi suffering a little bit, but uh, we're gonna wait for the game to start and we're gonna try and get a win. I know about this. Uh, playing Ricky Mario because he is my daily hero. I hate this hero. Like, let me explain to you how much I hate this hero. I absolutely want him to hate this hero. And for some reason, I've got a jungle legion, so it's ranked 2016 Dota apparently. So we are pretty much gonna lose, but nothing we can do about it. Okay, so we have a game runner in the Legion Commander. He's picked jungle. He's also shown that he's going to go mid, take mid from our mid for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why. He's just angry, I guess. Like, some people are just instantly angry. I muted him immediately when the game started because I could hear he was talking and I don't know what he was saying because he's speaking Russian. But uh, it's pretty much your typical, uh, as Seb said, trash tier Russian players. Uh, I don't understand why the man had to issue an apology. <laughs> Clearly, these people don't play Dota, uh, or well, they don't play pubs. They're used to playing like professional with teammates that actually maybe work together, etc., etc. So, you know, they're not used to actual game runners. And when I play Euro European race, it's always a. Uh, not always. I think saying always is kind of like um, unfair to say. It's not. It's not always. I have to be. I have to be honest. It's not always. But in general, if I have a runner, it's a Russian guy like this guy. So who goes Legion? He goes Legion mid. Uh, I didn't give any items to the... Yes. To the, um... Rude mother. At your service. So I'm gonna go give him one... Tango. Because the Legion Commander is not gonna give him a Tango. Because the Legion Commander is retarded, so... Quickly. Quickly. No, we don't have the support. IO is not supporting. Can you not? Tell, yeah, I know, dude. I know. I actually try and win Brood, but you know, it's hard to stay positive when you play Dota when you have these type of situations. So, Legion uh, Jungle is stupid. If we had a Legion offlaner with me supporting in this position 4, I've done it before, it would be great. I rearranged my item bolts. So I had a Sentry in the beginning, and I had um, what else? I had a Sentry in the beginning, and I had some other stuff, but I sold those immediately to get items because I'm going to need to go call this game. So. It's really important. So I'm actually going to be picking up two to three uh, Wraith Bands here. As I think that is good. Our Legion is going to sit for an entire minute in the jungle yes. doing nothing. Which is really good and really bad for us. So the only positive here is that my enemy team is just as noob as my team. So they are raging and they don't really have a support right now. So I'm kind of hoping to use that to my advantage. No, no. Gotta try and get an occasional deny. I lose the lane to Monkey King. I know this, so that's why I'm not gonna bother too much trying to win the lane against him. I'm just gonna try and get the deny whenever I can and get a last hit whenever I can. Every time I get a last hit, it's good. Every time I get a deny, it's good. Uh, I'm not gonna try to win the lane at all. As I mentioned, I don't think I can. But if I can just uh, get a good amount of denies, like two or three, every or one or two every creep wave, I'll be fine. So he's going to get his little Jingo stacks on me. If he's good, he's not. Okay. That's really good. So the Monkey King's pretty bad at Dota, which is really good for me. Uh, he, won't ever have he won't ever have any detection because, as I mentioned, he's bad at Dota. So I'm going to be using that to my advantage, hopefully. 
and try should I prioritize giving this last hit maybe? I think that was the right choice. So I'm gonna get like three um Wraith bands first. And then after I get the three Wraith bands, I'm gonna aggro these creeps so I don't hit the tower too much. After I get the three Wraith bands, then I'll get uh treads and then I'll get um I actually was really tempted to Got a single loss hit. Got a second loss hit. My bot lanes somehow fail. <laughs> Where they are 2v1, and I think they're the only lane that's 2v1, so it's, uh, that's a problem, but. Good. So if I can win the lane against the Monkey King, kind of, will put me in a good place. Good. Tanks on tower damage. I just want to stay out of the range for his stun and his uh, Jingu. I don't want him to get 4 ever, pretty much. He never gets four. We're in a really good position. Okay. As soon as we can, we do one of these. I can't hit me. I can hit him. Because of mischance. I say because of mischance, Dota. Okay, Monkey King. No mischance. What is this? 10% mischance. More like 0% mischance. When I play, I can't land a single hit. But when he plays, he lands all four in a row. Guys, what can you do when Dota is Dota, man? As I said, I don't, I don't land a single hit. He lands off one row. Quickly. Of course he does, because why not? Why wouldn't you let the enemy team get an unfair advantage in the game? Oh, yes. It's really hard to outlast. I feel like he's got a century, but I don't think so. He's, he does have a century. Oh, did I break? No, he must have a century, because I didn't break the inverse, so. He Quickly. must have a century. Quickly. That would be really odd. I'm not breaking in this, like, I'm definitely not breaking in this. No evil. I, it, it would be really odd for me if he actually had a sentry. Excuse me, why can't I get a why can't I get a single loss hit, Ricky? Thank you. Like, hello. I mean he's got the he's got the advantage, right? Yes. I don't understand my Ricky doesn't attack. Like I hit attack. And it doesn't attack. Okay, now I've got a much higher Miss rate, so if I don't miss now, I'll be very annoyed. I sprint. He missed his thing, but he gets all. You see what I mean? Like, how is this matchup fair? He literally doesn't even have to try hard. He just has to get, like, on a 30% miss rate, he gets, like, all his four of his hits in, and then he wins the fucking laning phase because he has one ability that can fully heal him. Really nice uh, hero design, Dota. Very nice hero design. Wow, fucking done. Quickly. Also, I'm missing like all my loss hits somehow, and I'm not entirely sure how. Which is not really making too much sense, but it is what it is. Ah. That was a hard one, though. So he is super farming. I did not go invis there. Why did I not go invis there? Every lane is losing, even though I'm solo top. I guess I'm against a solo Monkey King, so it's supposed to be more like even. I mean, I think he thinks he thought I was going for the dead either. Denied. So, I guess it's the right play. Okay, bring out a one now. Now we'll get our boots next. And then I will feel a lot more positive about the situation. Look at the balance, guys. He pushed one button. And all the harass and all the work I did is gone because he can push one fucking button. Oh, this game is so fucking broken, dude. Certain certain parts of this aspects of this game is so fucking broken. It's okay, that's enough. Really, some of this game is just not not made fair. Is what I'm gonna say. But what can you do? Are these here? Yeah. So the other one should be a two. Really Death good. Bounty. Do I want it? I think I do want a third one actually. As I feel like if I get a third one, I have so much. Ah, that one's not there. So there is someone in there jungle jungling. It's okay. Yourself. So I'm obviously having some mana issues. Yeah. So I'm actually going to buy the rubber magi first. Is my first item here. Nice fortification. Since you put it like that. Yeah. I'm in this. So him going Midas first is actually super good for us because it means you shouldn't get any 
Adams. I don't know how bot lane is losing. Like they not they, the thing is they're not just losing, they're actually getting completely destroyed. Like completely destroyed. I know I want the, the agility item here, obviously, because Yeah, he's actually going Midas first item. Which is kind of good for me. Oh he's got an HP. I thought I had an HP but I was like H Puff just took my last hit, I was about to be so mad. And H Puff just took maybe like a loss hit from him potentially. Your middle tower is under attack. I like it when enemy teams have nature uh, profits because clearly the nature's profits um they are good for me in the sense that I hate that that I think that shouldn't reset. I think the the cooldown should stay the same, but you know. I don't make the game unfortunately. The reason I do that every time is so that there's some kind of mischance or he will just destroy me. Okay, so now we're gonna try to get our trades up next. Our, our bot lane and our mid lane is completely feeding the whole time. As you what do you mean your luck, dude? You chose a mid boot against four there? counters. I mean, I don't know what you expected you to get, but... I mean, yeah, we have a fucking a jungling um, legion, which is definitely unlucky. But at the same time, like, you took a brood with no support when we had zero um, supports on our team. Let's get one of these. Yes. I'm in this, he can't see me. It's okay. He's got a sentry now. Oh, he's got a, he went defuser rush. Very interesting. Let's see, I want to see where he places this. You thought you were winning? See no evil. Okay, placed it. I have a tango, so I'll eat it yes. very quick. He placed it right there outside of the range of my tower. I already know that, so it's fine. And then you get fucked. It's that simple. Oh no, look, Mr. Monkey King, I'm too small for you. <laughs> You're mine now. Denied. Such a such a super hard to play hero, guys. Literally, hey guys, my hero just gets jingo with things because seventy percent uh, evasion means nothing in Dota, and then I push one button and I get all my HP back and do a ton of crit damage to the opponent and instantly win the lane. Who would have thought this? This was. Do you guys think this is balanced? Do you guys think this is fair? Is this guy ever going to do anything on the Legion? Like, I mean, it's fine if you go jungle Legion, but once you get your blink, at least, like, do something. Maybe, like, rotate to a lane or get a singular kill, potentially, you know? So we've got ourselves a, uh... What's call it now? Which is good. But we are losing to the Monkey King in damage. Here's one of these. Oh, I'm actually out of mana. Which is really bad, but I'm in this. But he has a Sentry. I don't understand how you can have a sentry. I dewarded that sentry. So he actually took all my. So I don't understand. Like now my legion that has been jungling all game that has not contributed to our game at all just fed. Excuse me. Like, can someone explain this to me? I'm gonna get Sanji Yash this game. Like at some point, someone has to rotate, you right? Be careful, dude. I'll fuck you up. So the thing is, what Monkey King doesn't realize is I'm actually just better than him. It's just because he oh, is a, has the stronger hero early game that he's doing well. Once he gets to the point where I have an even amount of shit, you are, he is fucked. He's actually fucked. When I have the same farm he has, he's done. His game's over. So he, I know his sentry's here now. So that's good. So now that I know where the sentry is, I don't have to worry too much. I'm not entirely sure why I bought the cunning blade. I guess I just bought it for like buying cunning blade. I know someone's jungling, so I should probably just go look for the jungler, which is the nature prophet. But he'll be um He's a DD. But I don't think anyone's gonna see it. So what are your feelings around having a top tower? At your Radiant just fortified. Like a 
How can I not jump fast? How can I not? How can I just not blink to that? That's insane. You guys see? I just could not blink to that no matter what. So I see the storm. And I see the MK. But luckily my bot lane actually made a tiny bit of space. I'm gonna try to get this bounty here if I can. Oh man. I've got like quite a few newer players on my team I feel. Maybe a Vanguard is not actually a bad idea. It makes me tanker and it builds into a abyssal blade which I might want late game anyway so. It's actually not bad. I don't know where- oh, here's my king. Hello my king. Oh, I was a bit late in that. Yes. I could have maybe stunned him. I'm pretty sure Monkey won the lane, but that's not that's like that's literally to be expected, so I'm not even I don't even feel bad about it. Uh, I'm gonna buy this here. More agility is just good, gives me armor, which I want, and then So I should be safe here. At some point, you know, the other four people on my team do have to do something. So I'm hoping that that day comes soon. Just gonna pull this a little bit overhead. Quick steal. Also gotta try and get these losses. This is very important. I got a single loss hit there. It's pretty good. Good. One king's missing. He's super farmed, so my team needs to be super careful. Got quite a lot of loss hits and experience there. Okay. Still doesn't have detection that I can see in the my century ward. Yeah, his century ward should be expiring actually. Just wanna. I want to make sure we don't get wrecked here. Get those Jingu Masteries down to zero again. I mean, you you saw that you've got this feeding game running Legion. I'm not sure what exactly he expected. I mean, I also don't know what the Raid King and the IO are doing. They've pretty much been like bot this whole time and. But yeah, my brood mother is, is inaccurately oh complaining because he picked brood last pick against the lineup that he knew was hard countering him. And when he knew he had a, a like game that. winning legion. So I'm not entirely sure what his game plan exactly was, but you know, it is what it is. Gotta be very careful here because if we get gone on here, we'll be in trouble. Right thing seems. Oh, it's got a radiance. Right thing's not doing too bad, I guess. So luckily for us, our right thing is doing well, which is really, really good. But uh, yeah, As you that's did. about all. I think going the Sanjin Yash is okay here. I'm not sure. We'll find out soon, I guess. At your service. <laughs> I, I hate that when I play against people, the Rikis get that spell off every time. But when I play Ricky. That spell just never goes off when I get stunned one single time. She probably should have gone defuser. So I know I saw that there is a uh, sentry from the Monkey King. So he's going to place it in front of the tower. I'm assuming. So I'm just going to place a ward right here. And then if you place it in front of the tower, which I'm sure you will, because I'm going to show that I'm here. Then he will maybe show it. I don't think that you should take this fight, Mr. Dude. I don't know why the Legion would fight a Monkey King who has a insta heal to full HP as well as a fucking um, Jingu thing so he's gonna hit way harder than you guaranteed so I'm not entirely sure I'm not entirely sure why he would take on the uh, Monkey King but you know good for him the right thing is, is decently farmed and he's also um, he's not playing too bad so I feel like there's still definitely a chance for us here then I both of these it's two range creeps the enemy team will not get which is really useful so I get a Sanjin Yash up and that is going to be very nice because it's going to give me status resistance which is really good for all the stuns specifically and it's also going to be a little bit of movement speed and other things that I want so okay so either the IO is DC'd out of a rage quit now, which is what I'm suspecting, or he DC'd before the time and that's why he died. I need to get back, Zeus is going to show me. 
So, and unfortunately, the yes, Jack, I'm what's him call it? Him, okay? I want to help this fight. If the Monkey King shows. Yes. Oh, I ran out of mana. It's useless. Food is gonna feed now. It's a situation of like the Legion kind of threw the game and then tilted the uh, tilted the what's my color guy and then that kind of lost us the laning phase. I'll be fine here. I'm in this. Oh, they have Duster. It's okay. If they die this, I'll out, but they won't. Of course, it's not. Of course. Of course, of course, the Monkey King lands the ultimate full distance from here to here. Perfect stun. That's all I can do. Get back, you fucking retard. So I've got to get the, the Vanguard up because, as you can clearly tell, the big problem I'm having right now is that I'm just obviously not healing in time. Let me get that please. Oh, oh, can I, can I, is there a specific reason why I'm not blink striking to these? I just don't understand this game, man. So I should get out soon. I'm getting out right now. So if I can ever get the uh, Vanguard up, I'll become a lot tankier. I need a Diffusal Blade, but like how am I supposed to get one? Oh, there's a monkey right here. Fuck me, I need to get up. The uh, the higher and the um the higher and the the, the rating aren't playing horribly. I just feel like we got so screwed by the Legion that it's put our entire game on the back foot this whole time. So instead of being at an advantage, we are just currently at a massive disadvantage. How much we can do about that? We should fight this though. We should seriously fight this though. We should really, really fight this. Oh, we lost. Like if he buys the blammer, he could actually just win right there. It's really big on the brood. I'm up in five seconds, so I'll help defend. I'm gonna TP to this over here. Well, I'm not. I'm not gonna TP here instead. So if one person comes, you could probably get a kill here. He's got. Oh, he's got lives here. That's why. Uh, the thing is, just no one can make it here in time, Since I guess. Put it like that. Yeah, he's got too much. He's gonna have a mask of death soon, and then he's not even gonna do it. Like, I don't know if anyone's ever gonna get here in time, but. At your service. Like, could they just not TP to this? Like 
Like, I don't know, did you guys see how long it took for anyone on the team to react to that? It was insanity, dude. It was actual insanity. It's really hard because I kind of feel like I need to carry it. This is just one of those really shitty games. You know, you get those shitty games in Dota. Nothing you can do about it, they're just shitty. Okay, I'm gonna get a defusal mix, I think. I think I need the defusal. I think that's, that's what's been missing from my repertoire this whole time. Just the defusal and I think I'll get instantly stronger. I just don't understand. Why can't I pick this up? Hello? Oh, my items are full. Is that what that is? I hate, I hate that Dota is not smart enough to figure that out. I fucked up. I pushed the wrong set of buttons, so it was okay. I pushed Q first and then R, but then for some reason the game pushed the R first and then set the Q for afterwards. It's a little bit unfortunate. It happens again. I don't know why they're taking that fight from me and Brutal not there, but I'm going to try to get to it as soon as I can, but I'm not super fast even with the Sanj and Yash. Just give me vision. He missed his stun. He missed his stun. He missed his stun. And these ancients are fucking me up, by the way. I think I just saw the uh, Wraith King absolutely miss his stun, by the way. Which is um, questionable at best. But yeah, my Wraith King is pretty far. So he's kind of carrying the game for us right now, which is very really nice. So high ground, please. Thank God, bot lane did okay. So because bot lane did okay, we are still in an okay situation. Let's just go. Go, 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 go. We should push, we should push. Zip, zip, you fucking dumbass. He's a past it, that's okay. I've had the fuse all. I could absolutely destroy the. Okay, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna hit this, even though I don't think it's a good idea. I'm gonna take this tower, I'm gonna focus it. I'm gonna focus this Rex if I can. Okay, I got it. That's all I want. I'm gonna get up. Post haste. I'm out. Yeah, that was actually not bad. That was really not bad. Thank the Lord. We have a semi competent fucking Since you put it like that. Wraith King and Io combo to make up for my retarded brood and Legion who still does not have a blame on. <laughs> I mean, I've got the Abyssal, I can probably, uh, the Diffuser, so I can probably kill the Zeus solo, slash the um, Storm, maybe, and probably the Nature Prophet. But that fight is really bad. They should seriously get the fuck out of that fight. I cannot get there for a very long time. So I'm just gonna go push top. I mean, Wraith King's giving it his all, but what does he do against that line with that many people? We have a, a crowd of buybacks, I'm just gonna keep pushing top for now. Is he actually gonna get out? There's no way he gets out, he's got Radiance, they can literally see where he is, right? Okay, let's get the Abyssal now. Or at least attempt to get the Abyssal. It's gonna be a very big pickup for us. I mean, I'm under farm, there's no doubt about that. I'm 100% under farm, but I mean, I was offline against a Monk King. And I don't think you're supposed to ever lose against a Monk King, so... Yeah, I was stayed around a little bit. Yep, I'm fucking dead. We need vision somewhere. I, I, I don't know what to do. And I need an anti, like, instant death 
Adam, but I don't know what Adam. I can get, so it's kind of awkward. I guess I could go like Axe here or something. It's just like, I don't know, our Ayo is not warding. He's got three wards, but he never places them. Just fucking place some fucking vision so we can actually see what the fuck is happening. So we don't always get picked off. Because right now I'm getting picked off every game because they just on us and I'm never on, on my, no one on my team is ever going on them. And no one's pushing out lanes. So I have to go push out a lane. And when I have to push up a lane, I get picked off. So it's really difficult. The game is super necessarily hard because of this. Did you put it like that? I don't think any of them invest, but I'm just going to put this in, in case the Nature Prophet does. But I think Nature Prophet just goes on me because he's stronger. But if we can ever get a um, relocate onto one of them, we'll be in a good place, I think. I should probably get some kind of wave pushing item next. Maybe like a Maelstrom. So i got to be careful about the... Uh, Nice profit TP me blood thorn in there. I could actually just insert like that. So I must be really careful about that. Other than that, I think we should be fine. That is a dumb fight. That is such a dumb fight. Okay, he gets the free kill, but that's that's really good. I have to get there. I'm, I'm I can't see the fight. Okay, I'm not gonna get that, but okay. Maybe I can get the storm at least. He's got 14 charges, but that's okay. He's not gonna have any mana. He has mana somehow. Don't know how, but he does. Just give me vision. Where's my team? They have no creeps. They have no creeps. Do they not understand they have no creeps? Do they not get that they have no creeps? The creeps are here. They literally have no creeps. I guess it doesn't matter somehow. They're going through back door somehow. And that's really good, but how? They killed the buyback monkey. Okay, we actually might win the game right now, right here. Carried by the Wraith King pretty hard. I think I did okay considering my lane and who I was against. Like this gonna he's gonna jump to this legion, it's very clear. Excuse me, Mr. Dude, what did you think? Fucking wow played Wraith King. Thank the Lord Wraith King carried us so hard. What a horrible game. Just this one legion is so fucking noob. What a noob hero, honestly. Fucking Ricky Mo guys. Like I hate this hero and I hate playing it and I hate making this rewarding and I hate this Legion commander for ruining my game. I'm right, I'm about to wait things, uh, whatever, he played well. And you saw how the Legion was going, he went jungle Legion, he ruined, and then he went to the bot lane and ruined. So it was just like, a guy specifically going out of his way to be a pain in the butt. Now this is unfortunate, because we have a Lena here, and we have a slot and Enigma here, and we've already made an Enigma video, and we've already made a Lena video. So I could make a Moran or Queen of Pain video, but I don't like any of- uh, Moran is great, I love Moran, but she's so weak this patch, I can't play her. Uh, I hate Brood, I, can't, oh, I physically can't play Brood, it's not that I hate her, I just suck, I'm not good enough to play that here. Uh, and Queen of Pain is just, I don't like it. So, I'll probably be doing a Lena off camera, probably a Turbo Chomp, because that'll be faster. But I think for now, we should actually use a Tango and eat this tree, make some good progress. The Tangos I'll use immediately to eat trees. I'm not too concerned about having to ever not finish the map, I will be able to finish the map no matter what. So I think what oh yeah, he has a brood though. So if I do play brood, maybe I'll play brood mother um, off camera on a turbo game, and I can I'll have to chop both. I'd have to get a, a win on brood. So brood is a two for one special. So brood is tempted, but I mean, do I care about a hero I can't win with? Probably not, right? It will take too long and cost me too much stuff. So we got a reward for that. So we're getting up there in the shards. We still got a long way to go, as you can see. I think it's like this, like that line right there. In this line right here. So Zeus is still has to be done, and then the rest of these are considered supports. Maybe Phoenix is considered utility, but basically Zeus to finish the side of the utility. Obviously these central heroes and then these heroes here to finish utility. So we'll finish utility first. I'll then move over to support, which is going to be so much better for me to make videos for. So, but now thank you very much for watching that salty episode of Ricky Mario off lane solo versus the monkey. I don't know who's supposed to win that lane up. Um, I'm assuming monkey should win that lane up, but you know. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe Ricky wins, but let's see. Uh, Ricky versus Monkey King. Who wins the lane? 
I'm pretty sure Monkey King wins the lane. But uh, I'm pretty sure Monkey King wins the lane. I don't know. Yeah, I can't find like a thing about it, but I think I think Monkey King uh, wins that lane. I'm pretty sure Monkey King wins the lane. But for now, thank you all very much for watching this episode of Dota 2 Jungle. If I release it, I'm going to be releasing ones I like, and I don't know if I like this one because of the Legion. It's a good, actually, it's a good video to explain how a horrible a game can be if you get a person like the Legion. For now, thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you next time with more Dota 2, um, where we try and get more jungle complete. Yeah, yeah.